Okay, I need a pickaxe. So I need some steel pipe. And beeswax. So off I go to find some of that, some some of those things, you know. Gotta find them. Welcome back. Welcome back to Among Trees. The most chill survival game you'll ever freaking see. I'm on my path to getting my cabin fully expanded. And uh, also exploring this very freaking beautiful world, you know what I mean? It's a very nice world. It's a huge world. But yeah, that's the, that's the goal. That's the goal, I gotta get the pickaxe so I can actually mine lime, limestone. And then uh, that's, uh, that's what I gotta use to make glue. Because I need glue to do the greenhouse. So yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing this video. And, uh, you know, if I see a bear or something cool, I'm going to hopefully make sure I get that on camera. But my name is Melomatic, and I thank you for being here with me. And I hope you enjoy. So I'll be looting, and I'll be exploring, and I'll be catching anything interesting that you may want to see. So let's chill together. Let's do this. So far, so good. Everything looks very nice. No bears. Which is cool, you know. I want to see the bears. I want to see them in action a little bit. But I don't know what happens, you know. I don't know what happens if I actually pass away. <laughs> uh, yeah. I guess we'll find out. I'm sure we will. Because I think I'll probably stumble upon a bear without even realizing it. And be too close to... Be too close to turn around, you know. I'm gonna pick these mulberries up because I'm gonna actually have to eat them probably. And it's raining. It's raining now. I'm gonna be just soaking wet. And hopefully not get sick because of it. I haven't seen any beehives yet. I've seen them in the past. I just didn't know I needed them, you know? Oh, it looks different over here. What's going on? I don't know if this is bear territory. Like, I'm just kind of walking, you know? Where are we? Oh, we're actually coincidentally walking towards the lime deposits. Which is okay. You know, I can't mine them yet, but you never know what we'll find on the way. I'm going to do some looking around. If I find a cave or a bear, you know, I'll, uh, I'll let you know. Hopefully I can, uh, Turn on the old recorder and document the whole process. Oh look, I see a beehive. I don't know what I'm supposed to do to actually be able to get the beeswax. Oh no, the bees are causing me harm. Do I have to cut it? Oh, I got it, I got it. Oh no, 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 no. No, where's the piece? Where's the piece, man? Oh God, are they chasing me? They are chasing me. Okay, that was not ideal. Oh, my inventory's full. I would like to grab that one just in case I need it for something else. What should I drop? Uh, let me just eat these real quick, I guess. Open that inventory back up. Okay, they hurt me a little bit, but I'm, not, I'm okay. I'm gonna survive. Cool, okay, now I, got, I just gotta find uh, some steel pipe. That's all I need. Then I'll have the pickaxe. Then I can actually go to those deposits and and actually get what I need. But my inventory is full and I do need to cook some more food. So I'm going to run back to the house real quick. I'm probably just going to go to one of these locations here because the, the loot does respawn. It does regenerate to some degree. So, so yeah, we're fortunate in that sense. But I want to keep exploring and opening up the map to see if we find anything cool all right i've visited both of these uh locations that i've previously visited here and actually found everything i need which is great very great now it's late i'm tired and uh apparently i think i'm cold because i'm noticing around the edges of the screen what looks like that kind of um I don't know, I don't know, like breathing on glass kind of thing, you know, when it's, I don't, I don't know what it is. 
I'm assuming that's cold. Yeah, my temperature's dropping. So I gotta hurry up and get back because I haven't been out at night like this, so I didn't realize that's when your temperature drops. Makes sense, though. So I'm gonna go back and craft the pickaxe, and then we're gonna set out to the one of one or both of the lime deposit areas. And hopefully safely mine some lime, but you know, I don't know. I don't know if at some point you're actually able to defend yourself against uh, bears and whatnot. Oh, I'm freezing. Okay, gotta hurry. Hurry. I'm exhausted and freezing. Get into the cabin. Hopefully it's not lagging like it was before. Alright, I'm back in here and it's warm and I'm safe. Alright, let me craft this freaking pickaxe real quick. I got everything I need, so there we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Now I got everything in the hot bar. Look at that. Very nice pickaxe. Sweet. Now I gotta go to sleep. And then tomorrow, on day 8, I believe it's gonna be, let's set out for our mining journey. Rise and shine. Let's do this. Alright, day 8. Guys, we got the freaking pickaxe. We're good to go. So, uh, I, I noted the ingredients I need for the glue. I'm going to just try to get as much lime and larch and yellow ash as I can. I already have one of each of the, the resin and the ash. But uh, it doesn't hurt to have more, you know. Because I need glue for, like, both of the additional add-ons. So, I, I mean, I might as well just get as much as possible. So, I'm going to head this way. Up in the uh, north western d direction right here, which is also like unexplored, so I don't know. We might find something good. Might as well whip out the compass. Head that way. So uh, yeah, on the way, I'm gonna pick up the the few things I might need. I also need to cook some food, but so far so good. No bears yet. Crossed my fingers, but I, if I do find one, I kind of would have observed it. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know if I'll engage. I don't know if I can out... I probably can't outrun the bear. If I had to guess, that's probably not a possibility. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get to that lime deposit over there. And then, uh, see what else maybe is in that area, too. Man, I'm just... I'm just chilling. I'm just chilling, walking around, trying to find this lime deposit. Oh god, bees. Bees, I don't need any honey, any uh, beeswax right now, so I'm not going to frick with the bees. That's They're aggressive, dude. Alright, so I'm wondering if this is going to be in a cave. So I'm right around where I need to be. Hmm, maybe it's down here. Maybe it is a cave. Let's go take a look. See if there's like an entrance. I kind of walked around that area. It's I, knew, I figured it had to be in a cave. But I didn't see any like cave entrances down uh, like over where the map actually marked it see I'm not seeing it I don't see any cave entrances am I going crazy see I don't see it I'm starving oh, crap uh, I gotta eat this and probably some of these there we go but I'm getting super tired too it's not good it's not good pick these mushrooms up I might have to go eat or like cook some more food yeah, I looked all over this area and didn't find a cave. There's got to be one, though. I got to find it. Have no fear. I got to go probably back to the house, cook, and sleep, but it's okay. <laughs> Tomorrow we will find it. Wasted a whole day. I'm just a terrible uh, navigator. I've said it before. We'll figure it out, though. All right, day nine. We're going to try this again. No messing around. Let's go. I got food. I'm starving. Alright. Let's do this. Whip out the compass. It's going to be in this direction. We're just going to go straight towards the location. And then maybe maybe going from this perspective again, I can kind of see a different path or like a different way in. Because there's, I know there's caves, dude. I need sticks too. I'm out of sticks. I know there's a cave. I've seen them say there's caves in this game. There's got to be. It makes sense that any minerals will be in a cave, right? I'm just going to sprint there. 
I don't see anything from this side. This is where I went, like the, the angle I went last time. So no. Maybe if I go a little more to the left. Because it might just, it might not be like directly on the little icon. You know what I mean? Like, it's probably not, right? All I know is I need to make glue. So I gotta find this stuff. I don't notice... I don't know if it's hard to spot from a distance. What's this? Is this just like a little tunnel again, or is this possibly a cave? Okay, this looks more like a cave. This this might be it. Oh, that's, that's actually pretty far away, dude. That's annoying. Okay. What could lime look like? It's gotta be like a whitish color, right? Oh, do we find it? I think that's it. Yeah, dude. Does that just put it in my inventory? No. Pick it up, pick it up. There we go, dude. Hell yeah, we're gonna pick up enough to make multiple things of glue. Oh, I see a, I see a schematic over there. I oh, don't fall into the rocks. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. Okay, I'm just gonna get all that I can see. Very nice. Now, what is this for? A blueprint. Water can blueprint found. Okay. I'm assuming that's for, uh, you know, growing stuff, watering your plants. That's a good, that's a good thing. We're going to need that. All right. I think that's it. I don't think we can get any further. All right. That's all the lime I see in here, but that's plenty. We got like nine. I think it only takes like two to make a thing of glue, so that should be good. We just need more, um, more larch resin. So I'm gonna stop over where that, uh, where that was on the map. I guess over here, while it's still daylight. Pick up some more of that. Oh, I need yellow ash leaves, dude. I don't have enough of those at all. I think I only have like two at home. All right, I gotta keep my eye out for that. In the meantime, and I guess you know, I guess if I do stumble on like. A beehive it's probably a good idea to get the honey and the, the beeswax I just don't want to mess with the bees man y'all saw what happened but yeah I'm gonna just uh, forge ahead continue with this little journey we got to get the the greenhouse and then the sewing room and I think that's all the rooms you can like add on so yeah I'm excited to see the house in its final form and then I'm, I'm curious to know, like, what the, the updates are going to be in the future, too. Like, what they're going to add. Because, I mean, it doesn't take that long, honestly, to... Oh, Yellow Ash, thank you. It doesn't take that long, honestly, to get, like, all this stuff. Like, I haven't put in that many... Like, I haven't put in very many hours at all. And I already got almost everything added to the house. So I know, I, like, outside of that, I mean, there's still map to explore. So I'll probably do that. Once we get the house done, because I want to see if there's anything interesting out there that we're just, you know, not seeing. And I'm sure I'll still miss stuff. But, you know, we, need, we still need to see a bear. And, and it, you know, if any other animals are out there. I don't even know if I'm going in the right direction. I am. Good. Still need yellow ash leaves. Like, I need a lot. Because I need to make at least... Like, if I can get enough to make a few things of glue, I'd be good, because... Oh, my inventory is full. Uh, I don't need to eat yet either. Darn. Okay. Um, let me just eat this. Oh no, that's I'm poisoned. Awesome. Crap. High percentage chance of poison. That's fantastic. That's okay. It's okay. I got. I actually cooked something that was like pretty beneficial for health. But I'll pick this up for now. I can eat this. Boom. Alright, yellow ash, yellow ash, where are you? They're not very, like, common. You know what I mean? Or they probably are when you're not looking for them. Alright, my health is dropping dramatically. 
need to keep an eye on it. I don't know what happens when you die. And I don't know how long the freaking poison lasts. But I have one of these that's good. That's this one right here. Alright, how long is the poison gonna last, dude? Because I'm gonna have to eat this with, like, I don't even need to eat it, you know what I mean? I just need the health benefits. Alright, that's got me worried. Is it gonna be, like, re like really eating one of those is gonna kill me? Alright, I don't want to worry about it. Now, hopefully that's enough. Hopefully the poison wears off. How do you get rid of the poison? I really don't know. I don't know what's gonna happen. That was like the only thing I had that was really good for the health, you know? Come on, wear off, please. Wear off. I don't want to lose like the stuff I got in my inventory. I don't know. I'm just gonna keep going, I guess. That's frustrating. I thought that was one of the like the the good mushrooms I could eat. I didn't realize it was the poison ones. Do these help with health at all right here? Oh, they do. Oh no, they don't. Damn it. See, this one's only gonna give me a slight increase. How long does this last, dude? I've only found three ash leaves, too. I need, like... I need, like, ten. What are these? Oh, dogbane. I think I need these for something, actually. Oh, I'm almost dead. No. Please don't let me die from a mushroom. How ridiculous is that? I'm kind of thinking I might just need to run home real quick, just in case. I don't know if I'll make it, honestly. I really don't know if I'll make it. This is going to kill me, dude. Uh, I guess we'll all see what happens when you pass, when you, when you die. We're about to see it. Hopefully at least a bag drops for my loot. My inventory because... Alright, what's gonna happen? It's almost there. It's almost there. What happens? What happens? And I died. Uh, okay, I gotta do all that over again. I'm not gonna record it. I'll catch you whenever I have all that crap again. Alright, I got what I need for the glue. And now I'm realizing that... Um, I'm gonna also have to get a bunch of freaking bolts. Bolts and uh, pipes so I could do the metal plates. So I'm gonna have to go venture out. See, I need bolts and pipes to do that and I definitely don't have enough. But in the meantime, I could do the glue. I might as well. I'll just do as many as I can. Keep it on hand because I know I'm gonna need some for that expansion. For the uh... Oh, I'm out of ash leaves. So I'm gonna need, uh, how many, how many for this one? One glue for the greenhouse, so that's good. And if we go upstairs, I think we need one glue for the sewing room. Yeah, perfect. And I actually found dogbane stems, so that's good. So planks for this. I can actually do this one, like, really soon. I might do that. I might do that. So, uh... Yeah, stay tuned for that. I think I can get both of these expansions done. I just gotta find uh, pipes and bolts. So I'm gonna go venture out and, you know, I'm gonna do that off camera in the locations we already, we've already, like, seen. If I attend, if I happen to stumble on anything else, because there's still so much of the map I haven't even looked at, then uh, I'll start recording again. Alright, I think I got everything. I think I got everything to do both expansions, so I'm excited. So, uh, real quick, I went to this little, uh, lime deposit down here, and I did find the tent blueprint, so that's nice. 
Um, other than that, I found a little uh, loot spot right down here. Uh, I think I found another one. Yeah, right down here I found one. Nothing too special, but there is one like right here, I think it was, where I saw a bear. So I evaded and I went around this way, you can see. So it, I do want to go over to that area because I think there might be a blueprint there. And I want to see if we can either sneak over and grab it, run in and grab it, and outrun the bear. I, I don't know. I'm definitely going to have to freaking save before I do that. But in the meantime, I think we got everything we need right here. Three pieces of metal and yada, yada, yada. Uh, the dog vein stems and the planks. I'm going to go ahead and do the this, this little room first. So I got planks here. I spent like a day, you know, an in-game day doing the uh, planks and the sticks. All right, let's uh, build this one. All right, we can sew our own clothes and backpacks, and I think we can actually expand our inventory by doing so. So this one actually gives us cold resistance and speed, which is, would be really nice. I don't know what a Walt's bleak skin is. Uh, cattails, beeswax, stump moss. So I haven't found these two items. I'm not sure where we're going to find it. Huh. What is that? I guess we'll find out. Uh, other than that, let's see. The backpack, dude. Two backpack upgrades. Okay, that would be great. Sewing thread, I don't know what we need to do for that. But dog vein stems, I think we could find old rags. I think I already have. Sorry, I keep hitting, ta hitting tab to like exit out of that. It's freaking annoying me too but let's go down here and do the the greenhouse oh I need planks need more planks all right 10 20 probably just 30 right I think it's like 28 or 24 I did it again tab come on man that's just muscle memory all right, yes. Plant seeds and get steady source of uh, vegetables. Ooh, this is nice. You know what I'm gonna have to do? I'm gonna have to craft the uh, watering can too. I might have the stuff I need for that. Let's go check. Cause I did find the blueprint for that too. I don't even remember where I found that one. So forgive me. I can't remember if I found it on camera or not. I think I did. Oh, I think I have all this stuff. Two, two, two. Nails, bolts, and stump moss. Okay. Let's go take a look and see if I have that stuff. I'm going to have to have it for, uh, for growing. I got seeds here. No. Well, I have one seed right there. Uh, I'm sorry for that voice crack. It's early in the morning. All right. So I need two of these. Where is my other stuff? Oh, I was in this first one. Sorry. Yeah, it's, it's super early in the morning and I'm still, like, waking up. Gotta be honest. As, as far as this section of the video goes. I think most of this video, like, this video has been, like, three mornings in a row of, like, waking up at 3 a.m. Well, I think that's all, all, all the expansions for the house. There we go. Now we can do that. I'm assuming we're going to have to take this with us to, like, the little river down there, maybe. I don't know. Let's see. Oh, I'm hungry, actually. Boom. Uh, let me... Look, I'm going to get some seeds. Get some stuff planted. I think I only have turnips and beets. So let's see what this entails. All right, uh, plant seeds with R. I don't know what just, okay, just planted whatever it wanted. Oh, switch seeds that way, okay. So turnips, I guess, are, are gonna be on the right. Uh, okay. Let's do beets on this side. Very nice. So it plants four plants, that's, that's actually pretty nice. So this this should keep us fed. That'd be this is gonna be super nice for not having to just scrounge for food all the time. Because I'm pretty sure when you harvest them, it'll give you seeds. 
Got one more turnip plant and come on. Tab, dude. It's E to exit. Why what are you doing? Okay. Alright, so we got three of each. That should be pretty good. Uh, I guess I'm gonna go down to the river over there and like see if I can get water. Because I'm assuming that's what I gotta do. Um, I'll make this my third hotkey. Oh wait, is there water already in it? Oh yeah. Oh, that's cool. What? Oh, this is nice. You know what would be cool is if you can make like a, a water catcher outside. For when it rains, that way you don't have to like go find water. But you know what's good though is like the water doesn't deplete super fast from this. So farming won't be super annoying. I like that it starts out with water too. That's great. Boom. Boom. I wonder how many times you have to water it. If you have to like water it once a day. How many days it takes to grow. Huh. That's awesome. So now, I still got plenty of water left, so I can just leave this in here. And... Yeah. That's uh, perfect. I'm going to just leave these in here too. And then rekey... Which one? My compass to three. Just by hitting the number three after selecting it. Uh, let's see what we need for the tent. Sticks and jute rope. Well, luckily I have those things as well. So we might as well just make it. Uh, it said like four jute rope, right? Something like that. And just grab a stack of sticks. I'm going to grab a stack of rope just in case because I don't remember if it said four or six. So this is coming along nicely, dude. We almost got like all of the, all of the things. I, the, the, the tent is going to be cool. See, we still need the, the campfire though because it gets cold. Like you start getting, like you start freezing. So we're going to have to have a campfire before we can actually go anywhere. And we need the fishing pole. I know that. I don't know if you use... I'm assuming you eat the fish, right? I mean, what else would you do with it? I didn't mean to do that. Hold on. Uh, the rope back. I'm going to keep the tent downstairs, I think. And even my, like, tools and stuff like that. But let's look over here real quick. Alright, so... The, the Waltz Bleak scan, I'll just have to figure out what that actually is. If you know, I guess, let me know in the comments, because uh, there's no, not even a description, you know, so I don't know, I don't know what that means. Like, it seems like it's an animal skin, but as far as I knew, you can't hunt. There's nothing to hunt. But let's see what it takes to make a sewing thread. See, fishbone and rope are good on, but I don't have the fishing pole yet right here, uh, whatever that is, and then the campfire. Other than that, we've pretty much, we got everything. But it would be nice to have that expanded. Because right now we're at 12, so we can go to 14 and then 16, I think it was, on the inventory. That'd be kind of nice. But uh, yeah, I think that's going to wrap this video up. Join me on the next video, because I'm going to do one more. Um, prob well, probably one more. And... Uh, I want to go see, I want to go check out that little bear area, see what blueprint may be there. Try to find the other blueprints that I need and uh, do some fishing and whatnot. Because other than that, until they start adding updates, that's going to be pretty much it. So let me know what you think of the video. I know this one was a little bit more drawn out, but the goal for this one was to get the, the house fully expanded. So the next one's going to be finding more blueprints and interacting with the bear because I'm really curious to see how that goes. But I like this, dude. The house. The house is A1. I would live in this. This house is like super cozy looking, you know? Like, look at that. I said in my comments I was just going to go find a bunch of like old pallets and scrap and just go build myself a cabin somewhere. But I don't think it would look this nice. 
But yeah, I appreciate you guys watching. Make sure you hit that like button if you liked it. Helps the channel a lot. Subscribe or consider it at least. Check out the Discord if you're interested. And uh, see you in the next one.